from iPods to iPhones, they are some of the most popular entertainment gadgets out on the market. Yes, but as Fox 11's Cameron Clark shows us, one area school district is using the technology to reach some students with special needs. They're usually relegated to backpacks when the bell sounds. But Sarah Hall is making a popular piece of technology a centerpiece in her Appleton classrooms. I've been seeing a lot of things on the internet about parents finding out where their child with autism has um, picked up their iPhone and they noticed how much with their own iPhone, so they ended up getting their own iPod touch and it exploded. That sparked the speech and language pathologist to apply for a state grant. You see, Albie, it, it figured out your name. You she has now been using iPod Touches, which have many applications from music to ebooks and games. What is it? Puzzle. Jigsaw Puzzle. Jigsaw Puzzle. With seven autistic students at Wilson Middle and West High Schools. I think the biggest thing that we've seen is how intuitively the kids have picked them up. We really thought that there would be a lot of teaching. Can you show me the mood tracker? but didn't realize how easy the kids would really take to them. There are several autism-specific applications, or apps as they're known. This is an example of a morning schedule. From communication for nonverbal students like Jordan. I need a break. To replacing many traditional teaching tools and able to go with the students from class to class. To do addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. I like the iPod better. Because of the success with these students so far, the school's principal is looking at using the technology in other ways. We're actually going to be meeting with an Apple rep and discussing uh, possible purchase of a full classroom set for a larger classroom size, and, and uh, part of it is because we're seeing the success of the pilot program that Ms. Hall has put together. I think it really um, sparked an interest, even district-wide and I've even been getting um, emails from people outside of the, the state. <laughs> but it's the interest in the classroom I use it every day. that's been most exciting. It is amazingly rewarding. In Appleton, Cameron Clark, Fox 11 News.